Oh, so this is pretty much it. So today we're going to talk about dominoes. Now, let's see a domino piece. Well, there are two six pieces, or some say it was a zero, or, well, eh, doubles. But since there are 28, you can count them if you want. If you count these, come to 28. But today we're going to talk about not dominoes, but the arrangement. The arrangement of a dominoes. A domino has something like this. These are a domino. This is a one four piece. Like these. But one four well dominoes arranging can be have like this. Well, the game of domino is actually what you need is not this but this, but we we'll just ignore that. So, you can have two ways for each domino, 2 to 28, multiplied by the 28, 28 factorials. But this is wrong, because of the, of the doubles. The doubles, well, you can or orient these. Well, they're the same. So, you need to subtract 7. So, 2 to the 28th. 21 multiplied by 28 factorial. If you calculate it, it comes to about 2. like this. If you bang the calculator, it comes to about these. You see it? Or this ten to the sort of fifth, yeah. Well, now this is not a script, but I'll just record this. What about a real game in which you need to orient like this? Well, let's think about it. This is a little problem. What you first have is that you can, but just for simplicity, we'll have two dominoes. Then. We have six outcomes, or seven. Seven. So we have 49 outcomes for first domino. But in the second domino, the first one has only one outcome. Like this one has a six. This has to be a six. Then this one has seven outcomes. So, this? Well, you can have the same one, too. So, what I'm going to do is, you can think about it like this. When I have... One domino, like one and six, or like this and these. Well, for these to meet up, then let's think about it. One cannot be used in this one. So it's actually not seven, but six. First six multiplied by 49 multiplied by six. If you calculate it, it comes to 294 outcomes from two dominoes. Okay, two dominoes. So we're gonna try for the three domino. What about three dominoes? Let's think about of that too. Three dominoes. Then first one, seven, seven, one, six, one, five. If you think about it, you can have like this the how many dominoes game problem? The answer, if you have n dominoes when n is smaller than 7, what it comes out is 7 multiplied by 7 pn. Okay? In this case, 7 multiplied by 7, 6, 5. But what about n is bigger than 7? Well, let's say 8 dominoes. This is a lot of time. You have all of these eight dominoes. Then let's put it in. First of all, what do you need? Seven. Okay. And you have seven. Okay. Forty-nine. One. Six. Six. One. Five. Five. One. Four. One. Three. One. Two. One. One. But let's think about it. What about this? Well, let's have an example about this. Okay, so we have eight dominoes. 
So, this one. So, let's think about it. Really. Seven outcomes. This one has, well, seven outcomes. This one has one outcome. And this one should not be this. So, six outcomes. And this one, one outcome. This one, five outcomes. This one, one outcome. It's four outcomes. But, this is not four. That means, since, uh, so I'll use a pencil for Think about this. Four, four, and two, two are different. So, not five, but six. So we've got the wrong answer. Then, let's calculate it again. Seven, seven, one, six, one, six, one, six, one, six, one, six, five? Well, if n is bigger than seven, then these outcomes, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven outcomes. So, if it is bigger than eight, then you should go to the p. And, well, it's like this. If this, if it is nine dominoes, what you need is seven, one, six, seven, seven, one, six, and keep going until you get the same one. Okay? This is just an example, so it could, it could be same. For, but for the maximum or minimum of nine dominoes, you need P again. But if you're in eight dominoes, you can just have seen like this. So, well, this is, this was a really hard problem. Let's talk about something, something nice here. Well, do you know domino is? Well, domino is real simple. One, tr one is monomino. This is for the monorail, okay? And two are the dominoes. D-O-M-I-N-O. And three are the tetromino, uh, tetromino, okay? And four is, wait a minute, quadromino. In quarters. And five are actually called the tetris. Sorry. They are called pentominoes. Da, 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 dun, dun. Well, these are, well, these are Tetris, isn't it? Oh, man. Oh, uh, no. Pentomino, yeah. Tetris? Oh, quite a bit. Oh, uh, no. What about six? Hexomino. And seven, well, I'm gonna draw this. Seven is heptomino, eight is uh, uh, octomino, nine is nenomino, and ten is, well, decomino. And, well, twelve is dodecomino.